In this tutorial, we are going to discuss about client-side image map, wherein which we are having a world map. In the world map for different continent, we have to create the different regions. And on click of that continent, we have to display the information about that particular continent. So we have saved the world map.jpg file in the same folder where we are creating the HTML file. And after that, we need to find out the coordinates of the image. So we are performing here client side image map where one image will get split into different areas, the different regions, and we link those regions to the respective page that needs to be shown when we click on that region. In the title section, we have written as world map client side image map. And in the body section, first we have used a div tag. And we are giving a heading for the page by using h3 tag. The heading mentioned as seven continents of world. Then we include an image, the world map image by using img tag. img followed by the attribute src. src is used to mention. src is used to mention the name of the file, the name of the image file. So world map.jpg is an image file which is saved in the same folder where the HTML file is present. Alt is used to mention the alternative message. If the image is not displayed or shown on the browser, it will show the alt message. Now, in order to include the client side image map, we have to mention the use map tag and the name of the map which we have created. So, in the use map, we have mentioned hash world map that indicates the map we are going to create for dividing into different areas for the world map.jpg is named as world map. So we are creating a map with the same name now world map. You can mention any name for creating a map. So whatever map name we have mentioned that name need to be used in the use map tag of image tag. So here we have used the name for our map as world map. And the same name we have used in the img tag in the use map attribute. So map tag is used to create a map with different areas. So name of the map is world map. First, we are creating a different areas by using area tag. In area tag, we can create a shape with uh, three different types of shapes, either polygon, circle, or rectangle. Now all the different continents will have different. So different pixel coordinates need to be found. It's not a rectangle or circle, so it will be definitely polygon. So we have to use the poly as a shape. So we can use the circle, poly or rectangle by default, its default value also. And its coordinates can be mentioned by using chords attribute. href is used to mention the hyperlink reference. So hyperlink reference indicates which file need to be called when we click on that particular area. And target we mentioned as underscore blank. So the when we click on the area, the new page which indicates the hyperlink reference will get opened in the new window. Target underscore blank will make the page to get open in a new window. Similarly, we have created seven different areas by using area tag shape me mentioned as poly for polygon and now we have to find out the coordinates for all the seven continents so we open the image by using paint software and we are now finding the coordinates of a particular continent that we are finding the coordinates for south america so when we move the cursor to a particular location the coordinates will come at the bottom left corner of the paint software. So first coordinate we have written as 465817. 
So from that, you move the cursor to another location where the border of the South America is there. So again, the coordinates you can note down in that particular location is 461.663. So similarly, you can keep on moving the cursor to the different border location of the South America. So we can just draw a line and where it is going, that location we can take. X coordinate is 411 and Y coordinate is 583. From there, we move to the next location of as the border of that particular region. So it is going to 501515. So that location we can mention. From there, we move to the next particular area of the border region. So we move to another location. So it is 612 and 621, 617 and 621. Slight difference. If you want exact, you may have to find out more number of coordinates. Next, we are taking another coordinates as the border area of South America, 491 and 775. And next, last we are moving to the last coordinate, 487 and 811. So these coordinates are for South America. So we take the coordinate of this and write it in the chords. So when you execute this page, you can see a hyperlink has been, when you open the page in the browser, you can see a hyperlink has been created for South America for not for other continent because we have created area only for South America. We are taking the link of South America from Wikipedia. So when we click on South America, the link will go to South America Wikipedia site. So we are not creating a separate site for South America information, which is already available file, internet file we are calling, internet website we are calling. So href, we have mentioned South America from Wikipedia, the page of South America and the page will get open in a new window because in target we have mentioned underscore blank. So that is the reason why the page gets open in a new window. Similarly, you can find out the region for all other areas, for all other continents by using the paint software. For all other continents, you may require the polygon shape. But maybe for Antarctica, you can make rectangle because it's almost like a rectangle shape you can create. So for Antarctica, we are making a rectangle coordinate. So while we are mentioning the rectangle coordinates, we have to take the coordinate of left top area and bottom right area for rectangle. So all the five continents, you may have to create the polygon area coordinates. Now, if you now change the width and height of the image after mentioning the coordinates, okay, if you calculate the coordinates by using paint, then if you change the pixel height and the image width and height, by using IMG tag, the image map coordinates will not work. So before you are calculating the area, before you are calculating the coordinates, you have to decide what should be the height and width of the image. So after finding the coordinates, if you change the width and height of the IMG tag, the image map coordinates does not work. See if you change to any other coordinates, it's not working. So what you can do is in the paint software, width and height, you can resize the image size from the paint software. In order to resize, you can click on resize option. Okay, from resize options, you change to the pixel resize and change the horizontal and vertical so when we change the horizontal accordingly, it will change, change the vertical value. So you can resize that. So the image size we have created, image width and height we have found from the paint software after resizing. Then you can find out the coordinates according to the new image. And that coordinate need to be 
used in the area tag. Before you are creating the pixel coordinates, you have to resize the image according to the size you want from the paint software. Then you need to calculate the coordinates. So if you mention now the new coordinates for Antarctica, so if you click on that region, now it will work because we have now found the new coordinates. So for this image, if you are able to calculate the area of our Asia continent, kindly mention the coordinates what we have found for the, for the Asia continent in the comment section.